Do you have to go? What if she doesn't like us? I have to work, girls. I need the extra money. I'm sure she's going to love you both. All the women in the neighborhood have vouched for her. I heard from Valeria that she's mean and smells like smoke. Since when do you listen to gossip? I'm sure all the other mothers, including Valeria's, would tell me if she was. All right, these are my daughters, Kayla and Journey. And I've written a list over there for you with information numbers in case of an emergency. Don't worry, Miss Gibbons. I've got it from here. You are heaven sent. Thank you so much. All right. Girls, listen to her. I will see you guys later, OK? My client just left. Are you still coming? Make sure to bring that spray so she doesn't detect the smoke. Okay, see you soon. My mom doesn't like strangers. Well, we won't tell her, will we? Or else what? You don't want to find out. Just stay here. You can do whatever you want. It's simple. Works for me. Finally, did you bring it? Yeah, is there a place we can roll up in here? Yeah, the master bedroom was straight to the back. We can do it in there. I'm not telling you twice. Oh, and the chef's smoke detectors, we're gonna have to take those down. I'll take it down. Just go roll up. I've had a stressful day and I need to take this edge off. I got you. Your mom said you can't do that. It's for emergencies only. Well, your mom's not here, so just shut up and play your games. Don't say that to her. You two can do whatever you want for the next hour. Just leave me alone. I don't like her. Me neither. She's mean. I told mom she was no good. We'll tell her again when she gets back. I think they're smoking back there. I don't know where my asthma pump is. Mom had it. Okay, I'll go light a candle so that we don't smell it anymore. was almost up in flames. And who is this? I'm gonna go. Is that weed I smell in my house? Are you serious, Marissa? I trusted you. I'm so sorry. I didn't know they were gonna start a whole fire. They could have died. Kayla has asthma, and I wrote it on the list. But I guess you failed to check that, too. What is wrong with you? I told you she was no good. She's me, and she took the smoke detector off of the ceiling. I am so glad I left my folder here. You purposely put my children's lives in harm's way. Your boss is gonna find out about this. Please, we can work this out, I promise. I won't smoke in here, and I'll babysit for free. You will never come near my children again, ever, or anybody's children for that matter. And 
I am going to make sure of it. Get out. I really am so sorry. I never meant for any of this to happen. Get out! Girls. I am so, so sorry. I didn't listen to you when you tried to warn me. It's okay, Mom. No, no, it is not okay. I should have listened to you. I promise you this will never happen again, okay? Come here, come here. I'm so sorry. Okay. I promise, okay? All right. Moral of the story, listen to your children. They may see danger before you can. Don't be afraid to do a thorough background check on the people who will tend to your children while you're away.